All right, uh, this is part two of organizing your Google Docs because I realized after watching the video that I said there was more than one way to do a couple of those things, but I ran out of time and didn't get a chance to show you. So when it comes to creating a uh, uh, collection, like I showed you the first way, is just come up here and click Create Collection. You can, and this is another way to kind of make sub-collections, you notice like this has a sub-collection that can be expanded or collapsed. If you want to create a collection within a collection, like my test folder collection, I, it doesn't have anything underneath it, there's no expanding arrow there, but I do have this arrow here that gives me some other choices. So from there I can say create a collection from within that collection. So now when I create a collection it's going to put it underneath that collection. Um, sub collection I'll call that one and you notice now it created automatically as a collection within that collection so you can keep those things organized that's the one thing I didn't show you before so there you see I've got uh, my sub collection as part of when I'm in my test folder it shows up as being one of the things inside of that collection all right so that's the second way to create collections the other thing that I talked about but didn't show you was I said there's more than one way to assign uh, documents to a collection I showed you by doing the check which I like because it allows me to do more than one at a time come up and click that organize button and then select the collections I want it to go into but the other way to do that is just not kind of the intuitive way which would be here's my collections over here here's my documents I want to take this document and I want to add it to a collection so I'm gonna make sure I can see where that collection is there and I'm going to take that document uh, and just click over here see how it turns it kind of pink or highlights a little bit I just click right in that area hold my mouse down and I can drag that document right over there and when I've got the subfolder or folder collection highlighted that I want I just let go of it and now when I go you see up here it says it's moved it to there and if I collect right here now I've got that in that sub document or that document inside of that subfolder so those are the two things that I mentioned in the first part but didn't show you how to do uh, like with many things and your Google documents or anything on your computer there's often more than one way to accomplish the task so hopefully that gives you some more insight and helps you keep your documents organized and uh, I have some ideas on future organizational topics like I posted and I'll be getting those organized and put together and sent out to you guys um, have a good day